Bismillah ar-Rahman ar-Rahim. We were talking about the importance of the day of Arafah and also the supplication of Arafah narrated by Imam Abu Abdullah al-Hussain salawatullahi wa salamuhu alayhi. All people who talk about Arafah, the day of Arafah, they need to talk about the martyrdom of the first soldier of Imam Abu Abdullah al Hussein, Muslim ibn Adi. He was the first soldier. He was the first soldier of Imam Abu Abdullah al Hussein who got martyred in Kufa and was sent by Imam to go to Kufa to prepare the environment for the presence of Imam Hussein. So the, those who talk about Arafah, the day of Arafah, they need to talk about the importance of martyrdom of Muslim Ibn Adi. And I need to take this opportunity and talk to you all brothers and sisters in Islam. Muslim Ibn Aqil provided a message to all of us who are waiting for the global reappearance of Imam Mahdi. If you are willing to receive Imam, we need to prepare the environment. We need to prepare the circumstances. The global reappearance of Imam Mahdi is in need of global human condition, global human readiness. They need to come to know a gap, a need for the reappearance of Imam Mahdi We ask Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala to send his blessings to the soul of Muslim ibn Aqil, the very first soldier martyred in Kufa by Ubaidullah, Ubaidullah ibn Ziyad. And Muslim ibn Aqil is providing a lesson. Those who are willing to get lessons, to get education, to get guidance from Imam, they are in need of preparedness. And Muslim ibn Aqil was sent by Imam himself to Kufa to prepare people for the presence of Imam Hussain. But unfortunately, people were, were not ready. They had just claimed. And I'm, I am afraid that nowadays we call on Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala for the reappearance of Imam Mahdi, but we have not prepared ourselves from within. Do we have enough knowledge? Do we have enough power? Do we have enough skill to be able to have a global state? A, a very small Islamic state in Iraq, in Syria, in Iran, in Pakistan, in Turkey is facing with different challenges and problems. Is it true to say that we are ready for the global state of Imam Mahdi? 